Hello, welcome to Western Christian Academy's tutorial for an online student. Before we begin today, we want to let you know that for this program, it works best if you use Firefox or Google Chrome, or you can use Safari for a Mac computer. The students are going to access the system for the first time by logging into westernchristianacademy.com, and they can scroll all the way to the bottom of our website. And down there, you're going to find an area called the members area. They can click on the initial login and the initial platform will pop up. The username and password will be sent to the student or to the email that's provided before the student starts their school year. And then they can go ahead and log in. This is a student's home screen. And the first thing you're gonna notice is there's this video right here in the front. This video walks them through the basics of how to navigate through this platform. Um, we have created a welcome course to, with an academic conference to help our parents and students to learn and understand the Ignition platform and our policy and procedures here at Western Christian Academy so that throughout the year, you and your student will succeed using the online program. So one of the things that kids need to do when they first start is go to their messages. And this will show up with a red number next to it if there's anything that's new in it. The, there'll be important updates from the staff. There'll be messages from teachers. They can respond to them. They can write messages back to their teachers. They can ask questions. They can just share whatever they would like to do. And then when they wanna get into their curriculum, they'll click on the word learn. So before we get started into their assignments, we're gonna look at their courses. So this is an overview of some of the courses that we offer here at Western Christian Academy. This is from third grade all the way up to 12th grade. You'll see a mixture of different courses. So if you're a third to seventh grade student, you're gonna have five main courses. Those courses are gonna be Bible, history, language, math, and science. If you are eighth grade to high school, you're going to have the main courses, but you're also going to have some electives and things that you need in order to graduate with high school credit. So one of the things that you'll notice in here for like Bible 500, we don't have a student actively working on this account. So it does show that this student um, has one assignment that's behind, but the other ones are all on, ta on track. So they're doing exactly what they're supposed to be doing if they were working on this. We also notice that the teacher's name is listed for each individual subject. And next to that is a little message box that shows where you can actually message your teacher directly from this page to the teacher. It'll also give you a count of how many assignments they have to do for the year and how many days they have left to um, finish up the entire school year. So the calendar system on for each student is set up and it assigns lessons to the student each day of the week. Holidays are taken out. Um, you guys can customize it however it works best for your family. Just talk to the teachers and they can help you do that in a more efficient way. So the students, oh, from here, let's go into here real quick. You can go into Bible. And in here, this is their first unit. There's the parents, you can log in or the students can. And when they finish an assignment, this is where their grades are going to come up. So once they have turned in this first lesson here, they'll have a score and you'll be able to see it and they'll still be able to go back in and access it. And then once they've completed this one, the next assignment will open and so on all the way down the line. So if they want to go back in and study for a quiz or they want any extra help or they need to call a teacher and ask specifics for something, they can do that and they can refer back to whatever they're looking at. This is also a great way for parents to find out how their student is doing throughout the year. Most of our students spend their time in the assignment page. This tells a student exactly what they have to do each and every day. So it gives them, this happens to be an overdue assignment, but then the next one, this one's not deal, due until August 2nd or August 7th. It will tell you if you have multiple projects, we only require the kids to do one in each subject. There are special occasions where they'll do a little bit more, that's okay. We'll explain that as things um, progress throughout the year. So let's go in and take a look at one of their assignments. So inside here, this is the actual assignment. The students will read their lessons. 
and they always have vocabulary and you can click on these little words here and it'll read the words to them. There's a vocabulary arcade game they can play. They're very interactive and they read through the stories and there's a little tiny tutor that will help them study and then they can click on where they can work on questions or they can read the next section. This one happens to have two sections. So we'll go ahead and look at their questions. So choose any answers that apply. People do not become Christians because of there, and the students will then choose their choice. If a student gets stuck on something in here, they can turn and they can ask for help. And if they click on this, a little box comes up and they can type a message directly to the teacher who teaches that subject. And this will show up in the teacher's side and that teacher will then respond back to them when the student will see this on their side. So let's go back into your lesson here. One of the things that this program does offer is if the students highlight a section of it, then they can go here to speak as and they can have it read to them in any voice that they want. They can also highlight a section and they can have it read in different languages. So if you have a different language spoken in the home, the student can have it read in that language so that there's a little bit more understanding. In addition to this, the students can pick up on um, certain words. Maybe they don't know what something is. Maybe they want to learn more about Jesus and they can copy his name or they can click reference and it will load all the information that it has about Jesus and the kids can learn directly about him. The other thing the students can do with the program, by using Control F, they can type in words in this box up here, and they can learn specifics. If we want to learn about Jesus Christ and everywhere it's listed in the um, program, they would just type it in and they would click the enter button and it would highlight certain sections and it'll show everywhere it comes up and where it talks directly about him in this particular lesson. It helps when they're looking for certain answers. Maybe they need help with a certain question. Those are always available to them. The other thing that's available is they can print their lessons. So they can do their lessons um, at home. They can do it on paper if you guys are going to travel. Whatever works best for their learning is okay with us. And that's what this, this is here for. So. And then they can answer all of their questions and they can go through all of the lessons and see exactly what was taught in the lesson. And when they're done, they will get their um, instant grade. The computer does grade 80% of all their lessons. And then there's sometimes it'll need the teacher to grade the rest of it, but those scores will sit there until the teacher is done. And most of the time those grades are up within 24 hours. So the students don't have to wait very long for their stuff to be graded, which is awesome for families. They look forward to working with this and the teachers here at Western Christian Academy. So that's kind of an overview of our program. If you have any questions, we would love to hear from you. You can do that by contacting us here. All of our information is listed in the website. You can type in your information or you can call us between 8 and 4 Pacific Standard Time at our 800 number, 868-5839. You can email us directly. And if you, if this answers all of your questions or you're interested, or you think that Western Christian Academy would be a great fit for you, you can click on the word apply today. And if you go back to our homepage, you can click on it there. There's also extra information on our website to show and answer any of your questions. We would love to hear from you. We look forward to working with you. Have a great evening.